Whew, what a day. All right. Hello, everyone. This is Alex again. Um, uh, I think today is the ninth or... <laughs> uh, I really do not... <laughs> I really do not keep track anymore, but let's see. Ah, it's the 11th. I'm sorry. It's the 11th of October. And uh, it's almost a month uh, since my um, accident. And uh, um, today I'm feeling much better from the urinary tract infection that gave me two day long fever um, from Friday. And uh, so far, um, so what happened was last night they gave me a different type of antibiotics and uh, I'm doing this IV right now. And uh, it seems to be working quite well because um, I was relying on Tylenol to reduce my body temperature for entire two days. Um, and then since I had the antibiotics, um, the new one, um, I haven't uh, had the need to take uh, Tylenol or anything like that. So um, I'm really happy that, um, you know, I bounced back um, on Friday, on Monday, and I'm able to do my uh, physio and uh, occupational therapies uh, just like any other regular day. Although I'm still a little bit weak, um, but overall it's been really um, great to be working with uh, everybody and um, to be um, back on track. And uh, I'm really, really, really grateful that uh, um, this two day long fever hasn't uh, affected my um, Monday to Friday progress yet. But let's see. Um, but so far, so good. Um, and also, um, I, I see a little bit improvement in my urination and uh, I was able to like do a little bit in the urinal and um, so that was quite interesting. It took me a long time to you know sit by the urinal and wait for things to happen but uh, um, it did happen and uh, interesting thing I realized that is that um, as I was you know trying to urinate um, I felt like my right leg was sort of like the outside of my right leg was sort of in pain, so I was massaging it. And then um, as I was massaging the right leg, it feels like I wanted to pee more. And then it's always almost like a, a sort of like a reaction to my massaging of my right outer thigh. And uh, I started to realize that uh, the... Um, outer thigh area on each side of the leg belongs to the, um, the what do you call it, um, the bladder uh, meridian in Chinese medicine, uh, which is called, uh, um, uh, can't remember Chinese now. <laughs> I remember the, the English, I can't remember the Chinese now. Um, uh, so this is like a uh, um, interesting observation that when I was massaging the painful part on the um, bladder meridian channel, um, I was able to pee more. And uh, so that was quite interesting um, to, to, to observe um, because that meridian channel all the way goes up to the inner corner of your eyes and it controls the um, auto whatever um, nerve system responsible for like uh, regulating um, uh, you know, um, urination and uh, sleeping and a lot of different things. So like, so these things are sort of all connected and then I'm just going to keep massaging more and hopefully like get more, you know, um, a, a more ability back um, from a different, you know, perspective. So um, that was like a quite interesting observation. And uh, um you know, little by little, um, uh, I hope that uh, my urination could go back to like a normal um, way <laughs> instead of just straight cathing. But I know it's a, a long way ahead and uh, it's there will be more bumps ahead too. But oh my gosh, it was so painful. It was so painful doing this uh, two day long fever, I have to say. It was rough it was like hopeless and then just you know in a ditch that doesn't seem to be able to like um come out but somehow um this new medication helped me a lot and um i was able to get better but um 
uh, it's not a easy process. Uh, I was a bit crushed by it, to be honest. I was like, oh my god. You know, when you're in that kind of like, um, I don't know what's happening, like, I don't know what's wrong with my body, it's just not behaving the way I wanted to. And then, you know, it's, your mind is started wondering, started uh, imagining about like different things and dangerous things and blah, blah, blah. But thank God, you know, um, uh, this medication really saved me. Um, so I hope uh, that's it for now. <laughs> that's it for the infection and all the, also the fever. Um, but yeah, it was it wasn't an easy process to climb out. Um, but also like um, today when I was able to sort of like push out a little bit of urination, I almost, I also cried. <laughs> I was crying for like half an hour, just like for like everything, you know, the urination, the improvements, and then the pain during the weekend, and you know my current situation and all <laughs> everything <laughs> i'm like a such big cry baby now because i cry a lot and also i need to be you know fed um uh, washed um to 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 get help to pee to get help to poop to <laughs> everything <laughs> i'm just a big babe cry baby so um but the body's getting stronger. Um, the uh, left leg is really starting to um, to get back to have a little bit of strength. Um, every day, you know, my therapist could see a bit more improvements than yesterday. It's like whoa, whoa, whoa! Every time, like she works with me, she 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 thinks I'm a fun case because there's just things just keep changing every day, and then it just keep improving. And, uh, and, uh, um, obviously I'm so happy, um, hearing that. And, uh, I'm just also like, uh, really, really happy that, um, both, um, she and me are able to observe this. It, it really humbles me a lot, um, that this body is so strong. It's so amazing. And, uh, that was also the reason I was crying. <laughs> but, uh, like sad and happy and self pity and everything just all, good and bad rolled into one kind of tears <laughs> oh gosh but yeah um that's uh that's uh pretty much it it's only like 2 p.m after i finish my um iv um i'm basically done for the day uh, i had all my um therapies and everything so i'm just going to um uh, something called occupational therapy, um, because they have like this. Um, this is one of the program they have here, uh, for patients to go to do something, board games or like music or singing or like just talk or just like you know going to the outside and hang out a little bit. Um, so I'll do that with them because I just recently got an iPad and started doing like a, what do you call it, uh, Procreate. And then, like, I've been trying to make this, um, this painting from Procreate. Uh, yeah. So, like, obviously, um, I still have a lot to go on this. But, like, um, this was, uh, the, one of the main ways for me to, like, you know, just to zone out and spend some time and just, like, draw something. It's so easy. It's so, um, fun to do. And then, um... I love doing it. So, um, my friend, uh, Oliver, um, recommended it to me and, uh, I really love it. Um, even during the weekend when I was sick, um, I still, uh, drew quite a lot. So yeah, this is why one of my main toys now. <laughs> I love it. So I'll do that after that. Um, that's it. Hopefully, uh, tonight is going to be a, um, smooth ride not like the past three nights <laughs> that's it for now bye bye